Fuel cells and electrolyzers are fast becoming the path to new and cleaner energy sources. The wire mesh plays a small, yet important role in this growth. You can use wire mesh in various functions within the subcomponents of a fuel cell or electrolyzer, including the gas diffusion layer, porous transport layer, gas diffusion electrode, membrane electrode assembly, membrane electrode assembly stack, cell stack, and others. Within these subcomponents, woven wire mesh and other types of media are used in the electrochemical stack to perform one or more of the following functions. Current collector, gas dispersant, electrode enhancer, catalyst anchor, and electrolyte substrate or slurry anchor. Depending on your specifications, a range of mesh counts, weaves, wire diameters, coatings, alloys, and more could work. However, as the price of raw material increases, it becomes especially critical to lower the total amount of wire used in the weave while still meeting the requirements. Porosity is one of the key specifications when determining which wire mesh to use. Porosity affects the flow of reacting gases, hydrogen and oxygen, through the electrochemical cell. High porosity allows for better gas diffusion, ensuring that these reactants reach the active sites where the redox reactions occur. The porosity of the wire mesh also impacts the water management and thermal management of the cell. The void spaces within the wire mesh can help dissipate the heat generated during the fuel cell operation, thus preventing overheating and improving the overall efficiency of the fuel cell system. Wire mesh porosity is defined as the volume of the mesh openings in relation to the total volume of the wire mesh, expressed as a percentage. You can achieve the same porosity with many different parameters. Here, we have two samples that have the same porosity but vastly different mesh characteristics. These plain square weaves have approximately 41% porosity. As you can see, the 30 cal mesh has much larger open area at 0.21 inches, as opposed to the 0.0021 inches for the 300 cal mesh. The 300 cal mesh has a much larger surface area, which is ideal if you want to adhere a catalyst, electrolyte, or any type of substrate to it. Because there's more material though, the 300 cal mesh costs 20% more than the 30 cal. The question is, how important is the wire mesh surface area to your electrochemical reaction? A greater surface area allows for more active sites where the electrochemical reactions can take place, enabling better distribution of the catalyst or substrate and enhancing the performance of the electrolyzer cell. A larger surface area can also affect the electrical conductivity and mechanical stability of the cell. For fuel cells, a larger surface area can provide a more conductive pathway for the electrons, thus reducing electrical resistance and improving the power output of the fuel cell. With wire mesh, it's possible to have a high surface area and a high porosity, or a high surface area and a low porosity. Consider the following examples shown here. All have high surface area with varying porosities. Each weave is quite different, and together with the mesh counts and wire diameter, allow for these permutations. The square weave has the lowest porosity because of its large wire diameter, but still has a reasonable surface area for adherence. This Dutch weave has a good surface area with the greatest porosity, while the reverse Dutch weave has the greatest surface area and a lower porosity. The many wires per inch means it's the most expensive. What does this mean for you as you decide which mesh to select for your fuel cell or electrolyzer? When designing your fuel cell or electrolyzer stack, you know your porosity and surface area requirements, and we know that you want the lowest cost possible. In a recent fuel cell development project, we saved an electrochemical engineer 20% of her total mesh cost by recommending a different weave that met the same porosity and surface area requirements that she was looking for. And we can do the same thing for you. No matter what your requirements are, partner with a trusted supplier that can help you source the right material to meet your specifications and timeline. Gerard Daniel has been a leading provider of wire mesh and other media for 70 years, with 20 years experience working in the electrochemical battery, fuel cell, and most recently, electrolyzer market segments. If you would like to receive a complimentary wire mesh sample book, along with more technical details on wire specifications, alloys, and plating processes, activate the QR code on the screen or contact one of our wire mesh experts directly through our website.